What is up, guys? This is Cubewack, and we are back here for the uh, second to last video of Pokemon Diamond, the Randomizer Chain Monologue. So, um, this has been an amazing journey getting here, and now we are going to venture through Victory Road. We're gonna try to keep a, the team we have from last episode through this, because I have I have built a bond with all of these guys: Obnoxious, Humpert. Um, Godbird, Rovet, Rovet, you are the newest, but I already have a pretty strong bond with you. Quinn, an outlaw, I haven't used you guys as much as I would have liked to, but you guys are still here. I'm still super happy you're here. Outlaw, you've built quite a bond because you've been here a little bit. And even though you haven't been the best on our team, you've done some work. Uh, and you've been here through all of it, but yeah, okay, let's, let's, I love this music, dude. It's like, it's making me really happy. Alright, well, let's go in. Now we have Victory Road music, which is a little bit more unfortunate. But alright, let's um, go get that item over there. Oh, crap! Oh, yeah, I wrote him. That's right. I thought it was going to be something else. Alright, can I run from you? Um, Do I have... I have Max Repels, right? Alright, but yeah, that's crazy. We only... We're going to finish Victory Road in this video. And then next video will be the elite four and that'll be it so yeah get ready for all that gengar what kind of gengar what kind of gengar um and then you're probably gonna have like a no you have an alex exam surprisingly enough so let's um we don't have any oh yeah we do never mind i forgot god bird knows you turn like a boss Look at that. Look at that. Brave! Mm-hmm. Oh, yes. Oh, dude, but... I want to learn Brave Bird so bad, but it it does recoil. Know what? We're gonna not learn Brave Bird for now. I mean, we could always go back and get more heart scales from underground. And then um, use those and go back and get Brave Bird. If I wanted to, I might want it for the Elite Four. But right now, I don't really want Brave Bird because I am not a fan of recoil moves. Especially a move like Brave Bird that does like mega recoil. That's just danger. That is so much danger right there to be using. Um, okay, so it's been a while. I have not played through this... Um, Victory Road since Platinum and Platinum's might have actually even been a little bit different But I have not played through the Sinnoh uh, Victory Road since my second Nuzlocke ever which was a long time ago Very long time ago like I've played through all the other games elite or victory roads that I used to play like uh Oh, that's it quite a bit actually I'm gonna have to go buy more Moo Milk too before the finale um but uh, the Sinnoh Elite Four I haven't done in a while, but I have done, I've done the Hoenn Elite Four, and I'm about to do that again, Omega Ruby, now Sapphire, I'm still super upset that, that did nothing, I'm still super upset that I'm not gonna be able to, um, this is bad, this is really bad, that I'm not gonna be able to record day one though, because I don't expect to have my capture card by day one, which is so, so very unfortunate, I mean, it's a, it's a, it's such a bummer, man. I was looking forward to that. I ordered my thing a month in advance, and that still wasn't soon enough. That's how that's how high demand this company is like under right now. That they can't even get that. It's been a month. It's been a month, and they uh well it will have been a month, but they can't even get so. Well, I understand it's in Japan too, but that's not the part. It's not like the shipping part. Like I'm not I'm not trying to try to bag on them or anything because I know like every, it's just business like. It's not their fault. They're doing the best they can. It's not like they uh, have a super store going. Like it's just a few people running a business. So I don't. I I respect that. You know, like they're just doing their thing. Um, I'm doing mine. But it, it's just it's a little it's a little bit um, disappointing. It's like on my part. It is my fault in a lot of ways because I should have ordered it sooner, but. Instead, I bought a lot of other things I didn't necessarily need. 
such as um, an Elgato capture device, which I could have waited on. But yeah, it is, it is, a lot of that is my fault. No, I didn't mean to do that. Dang it. Dang it. But yeah, I, I have to take a lot of that blame on myself. But it's just, I don't know. It's just, that's how busy they are, though. Like, people, they told me, because I asked them uh, some stuff about it. And they said that they couldn't give me an estimate because they don't they don't want to give anybody false hopes. But, um, pretty much what they told me is that um, on November 4th, they shipped out orders made on September 29th, which is over a month, and I believe that their orders would have only increased since then, considering, I'm just gonna battle you, but considering that it's getting closer and closer, there's probably more people trying to buy it last minute thinking it will be there in time, but it, it won't, it won't. Right, yeah, it's just, uh, it's just, it makes me so upset in a way, because I was so hyped, and I can't, I can't play the game. I cannot play freaking Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire, even if I were to go and get another 2DS, like, temporarily, like, borrow somebody's, I would not, oh, I should have chosen someone else. Oh, wait, I can't even heal up right now, and both of my water types are kind of screwed. Oh, wait, ground type should do actually some work. Alright, earthquake, kill, please. There we go. But, it just... I don't know, I was looking forward to that so much. Like, not even only the, uh, the let's play part of it. I was also looking forward to just, in general, like... Omega Ruby and F Sapphire, and I can't necessarily, I can't even play it until, until I get my capture device, because I want first reactions and stuff, because that is really what makes or breaks a series in my, or in my opinion, well, a series like that at least, like a remake game, especially, like, I'm so hyped for this, because Hoenn has always been my favorite region and stuff, I grew up with the Hoenn region, uh, I, I was, my favorite game of all Pokemon history, it's still Emerald to this date, and a lot of people weren't as, were, were not even close to as big of a fan as um, the third generation in general as I was, considering it was a, it kind of lacked a, a good after story. There was a lot of things the after story could have done to be better, and I know that. But I've always just the Hoenn region. I don't know if it's all the water. Uh, my favorite city was Fortree City. I don't know, but it's just I'm look. I was looking forward to that so much. Now, like, it is, I mean, I'm sure all of you guys can understand where I'm coming from, kind of. Just, like, imagine, um, the, your favorite game series. Say your favorite game series is Call of Duty, for whatever reason. I am not a big fan of Call of Duty, in my own personal opinion. But, um, yeah, I know a lot of people are. It's probably, like, the, the best-selling game franchise of the century, to be honest. Because so many people are, Call of Duty! Yeah, and they're like all COD fanboys and all that, but Why do you text me mom when I record? The... All right, hold on. She asked me about my dog. I have to say yes or why yes cause I forgot the E. I missed it But like Call of Duty, let's just use that as an example because everybody loves Call of Duty apparently um, Say you're a huge Call of Duty fanboy and Advanced Warfare is coming out and you could go to the store and buy a PS4, like say you or any console for that matter, and and like it was, it was like no issue for. <laughs> I should have switched out. We just got wrecked. Um, there goes Rev <sighs> our ace from the last gym survived to get smashed by a Machamp. Same level as the other gym leaders ace. That is sad. Saddening. God dang it. Alright, there goes our... Well, links don't really matter anymore. It's still going to be updated on the layout, of course. I don't want to be like a lazy video maker and not update the layout. Because it doesn't matter, but... 
That just sucks. Right, can you look the other way? Just kidding, I'll battle you. I want vengeance now for that. Screw you, Chingling. That shouldn't even be a Chingling anymore. So I'm gonna U-turn to Chingling and kill it. I'm gonna switch into myself. Just kidding, I can't do that. Uh, now we gotta go to Outlaw because Outlaw hasn't been doing nothing. No, 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 no. Chimeco. Send in your Chimeco. See how much I care about your Chimeco. There, that's how much I care about your Chimeco. But... Yeah, okay, so back to the thing I was saying. Call of Duty, and you could buy a PS4. Like, it was no issue. You had the money. You could buy one on the spot. I don't have Waterfall, that's right. I might need it. I'm getting a phone call. Hold on. Alright, so, um, yeah. I just won on an adventure. The phone call I received was from my neighbor... We have to teach waterfall right now too. It's from my neighbor asking me for a ride to freaking um get his car. He had to get pick up his car from the mechanics. So he went and he did that. Or we went and we did that. I brought him because like I feel like an ass if I told him no. So I can't, I'm not just gonna be like, hey man, I know you kind of need your car to get to work on time in like 30 minutes, but. He doesn't work, like, extremely close either. He, he has a little bit of a drive, so... Yeah, it's 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 a little little tricky, you know? It is a little tricky to do that, but alright. Alright, I'm making it already strong. Ooh, a get bite. Um... I don't want to use... I'll just fly. Who cares? Who cares what I use? You're gonna die. Oh, we got the crew... We got the crit. What do you know about crits? What do you know about crits? And the whole PS4 analogy, Call of Duty thing I was doing, I'm, I'm not going to finish that analogy because I had no idea where I was going with that. But Alright, what is this? Razor Claw. Oh well. I just realized something. What the heck? Where's my bag? bag? Where is it? Where is it? I got Dragon Pulse. I picked that up and I didn't even like, I, know, I acknowledged it in my brain. I didn't even like think like oh yeah, I didn't even think about it. I was like, wait, what? Oh, that's crazy. Dragon Pulse. Silver can we teach anybody Silverwind? No, we can't. Alright. Um, let's not battle you, because I don't think I even have to. Oh yeah, I do. I see exactly where I have to go. Alright. The path is clear. Hey, 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 get out of my face. Get out of my face. I don't need you and your tentacruel. That's no issue. That is no issue at all. For that did so much. That did so much. Yeah, we're gonna switch for that golem. Definitely. I'm not. I'm not messing with no golem. Um. Yeah, you're dead, golem. And Polion. Ooh, that. That's risky. Godbird, you might be able to just brave through this thing right now. Yeah, okay. Thank God. Because Empoleon probably would have wrecked Godbird had um, had he had not O-Code. Alright, up this wall we go. And now we need somebody else out front because you are weak. Humper, get out there. Alright. Gibble. Gibble, gibble, gibble. Um, Earth power should do... Normal, right? It's neutral, right? Yeah. Gerado. Do, 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 do. No, no. God, no. Gyarados. Oh, I can't heal up. I can't heal up. I am scared. Nobody here is good for you. Nobody. Alright, Dragon Pulse, please do a lot. <laughs> yes, fist pump. Because you have to recharge and that was a crit? How is that a crit? How am I not dead? Gibble. Oh, we could wreck this thing though. Dang it. I could have wrecked that Gibble. Oh well. Oh well. I would have wrecked that Gibble so bad, but I was scared. Alright, that's it. We've made it. Victory road. Cleared. There's the music again. 
And you guys might be thinking, oh, you have one more encounter here, but no, I don't. It's also called Pokemon League, so it is technically, like, the same place. But if I come in here very carefully and avoid walking down the center, I can come and heal up so I don't initiate the next rival battle. And I could also very carefully walk over here to the PC and bid farewell to our friend. Number 14 to go on our journey. You made it really close to making it to be able to be in the Elite Four, but unfortunately you were too brave and oblivious with no item. Look at all these guys, dude. 41 was the death level. Look at that. Um, 42 right there. We got any other 41s? No, we don't. But all right, the next step is choosing our team for the final. I'm not gonna do any other layout changes this video because it's very close to being over. But I am gonna look up right now Pokemon Diamond Elite Four. So that I know what I'm working with here. And I know how to build a good team for this that doesn't have to be super overpowered. Because otherwise it would have to be a super overpowered team. But alright, let's check it out. Number one, Aaron. He is a bug type guy. His highest being a 57. Which is freaking nuts for the first member. Um, second member is ground slash rock. Fourth member is, or third member is flint, which is supposed to be fire, but he has a lot of not fire type Pokemon. But I'm assuming all know flamethrower or fire punch. If you saw them, you would agree. Fourth member, Lucian, uses a psychic type, with I, which I kind of have a Pokemon for. And then, of course, Champion Cynthia uses um, six Pokemon of different types. But um, her team is kind of a mixture of the rest, in a way. But, alright. So, let's build a team right now. So, first type is a bug type somewhat. Here, hold on. Let me get my iPod, too, so I can check out these Pokemon's typage. Because a lot of these aren't the same uh, type as their trainer. So let me, uh, what was it? Where's my app? Where is my Pokedex app? And this right now, this part of the video might not be too entertaining. Because this is more of a uh, serious note, so yeah. But, okay, first Pokemon is, well, he has one Pokemon that is not a bug type. But he would, hmm... Well, I think this thing actually has, uh, this Pokedex actually has what type is good. Yeah, it does. Um, alright. Oh, we do have somebody for you, actually. Okay, yeah. Alright, sweet. So, first guy, first trainer, Humpert is going to be in charge of that. Humpert is going to deal with the bug types. And, um, the final Pokemon that Aaron has because Humper can handle it. All right, so Humper, you're officially on the team. All right, second trainer. The ground type, but he also has two water ground types. So we're gonna have to compensate that. We don't have any grass types, which is very, very unfortunate in this situation, but we might be able to compensate for that because the ground type, we could, uh, we could use, we could use two water types, definitely. We could use a few water types for this Elite Four. That is a, a, a for sure thing right there. And our first water type, of course, is going to be Obnoxious. This actually, this Elite Four doesn't have a Dragon type trainer. So yeah, I don't really need to worry about Dragon types, but Obnoxious is going to be our first water type. And Quinn is our possible second, depending. I wanna see if we have, we have, that's Bug. I wanna see what grass type moves do we have in here. Um, I know we had one at least. Grass knot. All right, that's the one I was looking for. Quinn, you could learn that. So actually, Quinn, you're definitely gonna be with us for this. Um, 
Okay, we're gonna go to Headbutt, as stupid as that may seem. But I want to keep Water Pulse, and I want to keep Psychic, and Nasty Plot. Nasty Plot can come in a lot of use for this, um, if I could set up correctly. And then, wow, my Pokédex app just, like, failed on me. Hold on. Let me exit out of that. Alright, so there we go. We have two Pokémon, two Water Types now dedicated, so Obnoxious and Quinn. Obnoxious isn't really for anybody, he's kind of an overall, but okay, next type is Fire. We actually kind of already got that set up. Um, but he does have a Normal type and a Ghost Flying type, you can probably guess what those are. But, I do, I, I want to keep Godbird, because Godbird's close combat could come in a lot of usefulness here. If actually a few of these Pokemon, so I might want to keep that. But there's also that, that, uh, that Ghost Flying type, which is going to be... A bit of a challenge, so let's see. Anybody with us at the moment? Can any of you guys learn Thunder? No, you can't. Um, unfortunately enough, the first Pokemon that's gonna be actually cut from the team for the Elite Four is going to be Outlaw. Outlaw, I see no use for you here. Wait, I might need Outlaw, so don't hold that to me yet. I might actually... Uh, end up losing using Lord here. I want to see if Lord can learn Thunder because I have a weird superstition that they she might be able to. No, she's not. She can't. Can you learn Thunderbolt? No. Okay. Never mind. Never mind that idea. Um, I know one Pokemon that can learn Thunder, but I have to evolve it first, and that is uh, if I had a Gyarados that could learn Thunder. But all right, Lord, I'm not gonna maybe not need you either then. Um. Can anybody slip? Ooh, slip has good uh, type. There's slip is pretty good too because it's a normal type, so its only weakness is fighting. And that ghost type will not even be able to hurt it with any ghost type moves, luckily. And yeah, you could learn thunder. So yeah, okay, slip. Welcome to the team. You are going to have to grind to hell and back. But you got thunder. Um, do I want to teach thunderbolt as well? I don't think I do. What else do I want to teach you while we're at it then? Um, can you like charge me? That you can. You can learn like everything, can't you? I can't learn Brian. Can you learn Drain Punch? No, you can, but I don't really want you learning that. Silver Wind. Yeah. Okay. Never mind. Never mind. But you are definitely gonna come with us because you got Thunder now. So Slip, welcome to the team. So these five are on the team. So we only got one more that we need. And that is preferably a bug type. And I want to see what moves my current bug types have. So let's see. We have Neo, which is going to be very nostalgic if we use him. We have Outlaw here, who is the closest to the right level, but doesn't know many bug type moves. May not be that good. And we got, we got Taxi, who I don't plan on using actually at all. And then Lord. Lord is looking like our best bet, to be honest. Um, but I, I want to check out movesets first. I mean, Lord is obviously a better Pokemon than Neo, so I don't know. Okay, you know, a Power Gem. That's a Rock type move, though. Your order and stuff. I don't know. I'm gonna look up your move set actually right now, and we'll see. This, sorry about this video being really long at this part. I mean, I just want to make sure I have a good team, and I kind of want to get this part on camera as well. Just so you guys know what we're doing with next episode. I mean, you're probably you probably already stopped watching. I don't blame you. But all right, at oh at 37, you learn a really good move. Okay, yeah, we're gonna use you, and then hmm, sucks that you can't learn that one move right there that I'm looking at. But all right, you're actually gonna learn a pretty decent move. Uh, later on in training, so yeah, that's for Quinn. I think you're gonna be our final member to the team. So let me check and see if we're gonna have a hard time with anything here. I see one, two, two Pokemon. No, just one actually. That might be a really big pain in the arsenal, but. Um, our level advantage because they're one of the lower levels from that team so we should be pretty good for that I guess but yeah these other guys okay yeah these other Pokemon are just they're just freaking gonna get wrecked to the max 
Alright guys, if you enjoyed watching this video, please leave a like to show your support. And as always, I am Kubrick, I am signing out, and I will catch you guys next time. Peace!